Hello and welcome to Jumper Johnny Gaming. This video is going to show you how to get the achievement One More for the Sticker Book for Jurassic World Evolution 2. This achievement is for hatching and releasing every single dinosaur in the base game. If you have got the pre-order dinosaurs or any DLC or future DLC, you may have to do those dinosaurs as well. You cannot do this in free mode, as to use any dinosaur in free mode, they have to be unlocked in the other modes first. So this achievement should be left until you have done story mode, chaos mode and the challenges. Every mode and level comes with a different set of dinosaurs, so you can't just pick one level and research every dinosaur. Also, any wild dinosaurs that are part of the storyline and you encounter count if you tranquilize them and put them in your park, bypassing the research and archaeology. A good tip that you should do is that every mode and park that you do, apart from the storyline dinosaurs you have to do, make sure that when you are researching and putting dinosaurs in your park, make sure it's a new one every time, and you can always check on your database what dinosaurs you have unlocked so far. Once you have exhausted all the maps and completed the campaign, chaos mode and challenge mode, don't be intimidated by the challenge modes. On easy difficulty, they are a lot easier than chaos mode. And as soon as you've got several dinosaurs, you always get profit. And you don't have to complete them in part time, and you'll still get an achievement every time you 5 star a challenge mode. Which there is 5 challenge modes in total. And you have to unlock all the challenge modes to get a few dinosaurs that are not in any other modes. This is a very time consuming achievement. There are 79 dinosaurs in the main base game, and the Indoraptor can be done in the Northwest USA. You have to have three strong dinosaurs as one of the objectives in the research line. I use Hesasauruses as they have a 25% chance already. Cheap to do and you can use genetics to bump it up to guaranteed. You need 100% genome for the Raptor, T-Rex and Gigantosaurus. You have to release a Dodominus Rex and then you can research the Indoraptor which is the most expensive to research in the game. And you have to have a lot of scientists with max stats so you might have to research more staff centers and upgrade points first. And lastly, the Syntosaurus is only available in the Southwest USA. If you find any missing, check the list coming up for all the dinosaurs, find the ones you are missing, then go to any hatchery on a level and it will tell you what dinosaurs you can make in the level. Also, Canada is the one that does all the aviary and marine dinosaurs. Now, here's a funny little dinosaur. A correction, a pretty decent sized one, if the truth be told. It's called a Cintosaurus. The T is silent, like the P in swimming. <laughs> yeah, and it has a mohawk. At least, that's what I'd call it. If you like this video, subscribe to my channel, where there are achievement guides, secrets and tips from the latest releases to retro games posted every week. Thanks for watching.